Verve, online devotional videos. Luke chapter 18, verses 10 to 14 tells the story of two men praying. They're at the opposite ends of the social strata. A Pharisee, which means a religious uh, 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 man that was well-loved and, 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 and had arrived in society's mind. And a tax collector, which means he was vermin, he was, he was disgusting, he was loathsome. And the Pharisee prays and says, God, I thank you for who I am. I thank you that I'm a Pharisee. I thank you that I tithe. I thank you that I fast. I thank you that I'm a good man. And God, I thank you that I'm not like that man over there. And then the tax collector prays and says, God, be merciful to me, a sinner. Jesus asked this question, who do you think was justified? Who do you think prayed right? He says it wasn't the Pharisee, but it was the tax collector. Because when we humble ourselves, that's when he exalts us. And the tax collector knew something that many of us forget. The only person that matters is you and God. No one else is our excuse. No one else can be pointed at. If we humble ourselves, we will know his presence. So many times people in struggling and in marriages and relationships say, I only did this because of that, and you did this and you did that. That prayer doesn't work. This prayer works. Oh God, be merciful to me, a sinner. I know I need you, God. I haven't had anything I can brag about, God. My heart needs you. Get to that place where it's just you and God and your cry for his mercy. Then you will see the hand of God. Verve, devotional videos to your inbox.